Okay, so, this is Terraria once again, and today we will be facing the Expert Mode Pumpkin Moon. We've done this once before, and gosh, there are an army of pumpkins. Can I start it? Can't yeah. start it yet. Not quite night time. I'm just going to start it as soon as I can, alright? Okay. In our next video, which will be right after, which will be, okay. In our next video, which will be right after this video, we'll have Expert Mode Golem against Centrets, which are these things. And that should be for pretty cool. But don't worry, we'll have more Centrets than just two. Because we will both have on armor, armor specifically for spawning in more Centrets. So yeah, I'm gonna use Betsy's Wrath until Morning Wood starts to come. Oh, never mind. Morning Wood's already coming. <coughs> but until I see a Morning Wood, I'm just gonna continue to use the Betsy's Wrath to, to bomb yeah, these guys. Well, I don't see it, so I'm still using the Betsy's Wrath. No, you're ki you're killing the nurse. It's not it's not good to it's hit not prohibited. women. It's not good manners to hit women. Okay. There you are, Morning Wood. That's uncool to hit women. You honestly aren't the gentleman. And here comes right Pumpkin. Here. Oh, I couldn't jump. It wouldn't let me for some reason. Now, one Pumpkin isn't too much, but when they start spewing Pumpkins at us, that is when it becomes done not. <laughs> that is when it becomes truly difficult to survive. There's another pumpkin right there. And the reason that you're not seeing too many is because my brother has on a warrior set, which, if you didn't know, tar makes enemies target him. So that's why everything's always going after him. I'm doing terribly. Right now. Without my dash ability, I wouldn't have escaped that wave of flames. So yeah, if, in case you didn't know, the solar armor actually enables you to, to use some kind of dash that makes you move really quickly for like a very short period of time. And it can actually be used as an attack as well. So you also have a buff with the, with the full solar armor up called the Solar Blaze. It says, damage taken reduced by 30%. Repel enemies when taking damage. And basically what this does is, I explode on contact with enemies. I don't like self-destruct, but an explosion happens in my area. That doesn't d destroy tiles or anything, but it will damage enemies. And it's actually very useful in most situations. This is, I can only dash with when the shield is up. So I actually want to keep the the enemy is hitting me to a minimum. And the shield actually helps with that because I can dodge. Otherwise, I just need some skill to dodge. But with the shield, it's actually pretty easy. It's also good for getting out of the way really quickly, aka dodging. <laughs> oh my goodness. Here comes the army. It's wave 14. There are three right here. The ground is not about to be safe at all. Because it's just headless horsemen and others. Oh gosh, I didn't realize. Oh, I dropped one platinum coin and nine gold. I need to put it I need to put some of this stuff in a chest, and there's even an army of headless horsemen. That's my money that you're that you're sitting on, Mr. This is Swinterling, so I will gladly take it back. Oh, nope, there's them. Oh, 
Oh, oh well. no, I hate when this happens. When the armies cross. That's what we're gonna call it. When the armies cross. That's what that is. That's when me and Jacob are both leading armies of pump kings towards each other. Do you see? Look on the look on the mini map. Yeah. Do you see how many pump kings that is? I want to get somewhere where I can stand still. And oh gosh. Uh oh. Oh my gosh. I don't even. No, they're coming. No, no. I hate it when they like dash towards you like that. And there's just like a. I you really of oh no oh no oh no just fly that's all i have wait if i use this will this be better it probably will I want to collect these damage pieces so I can get rid of these things really quickly. Oh gosh. Heal. Regenerate. Oh my gosh. Oh, I almost made the army cross again. What the heck? I hate it when you, like, have to make the army shift directions. And then, like... You don't even have all that many after you. I was just stuck in a tiny hole with a whole bunch of, um, both pumpkins and morning woods. No, the armies are gonna cross! I know, I'm taking mine lower to the ground. I hate it when they just, like, dash at you, like... That's actually kind of an opportunity for me, because... How? To hit them. No, 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 no. Okay. No armies, no crossing. No! Fishron, I said go away. Oh my gosh. Oh! Um, those morning woods were obviously weren't happy to see me. What? I told you to go away. Me? No, not you. I was like, what did I do? I was riding my my mount, and then it, and then I pressed my unmount button, and it just kept making me ride. I know that's what it did for for my fish rod. He was a bad boy. Okay, so I think I've only died once now. I need a faster mount. Get the fastest forever flying mountain game. I think I should actually use my wings to make the armies turn. And then just fall and fly up. Well, I'm not that smart. Though. Oh! Oh no! Crossing armies! I fell into the crowd. This is actually working better. I'm at two hearts. <sighs> okay, so this is what the second time I've died. Look at look on my mini map. There are so many splinter not splinterlings, morning woods. Just fly up. Fly this way. Oh my goodness. Then fall. Yes, oh, there's only one for some reason. One army? Or no, there's only one pump king. Oh, another one just came from the sky. I uh, just like one army and one pump king. <laughs> oh no. Oh no! Yeah, oh, these no. are intersecting again. At least I only had one this time. Oh. <gasps> it ended. Oh my god. I'm not giving up on this morning wood. Okay, let's come down here. And see what all we we can collect. We killed so many pump kings. The pump kings but there were like, we killed so many green machines. <laughs> we actually did really good because we only killed two of them. 
Oh my gosh. <sighs> so much stuff. This is morning wood trophies. Let's just go put that. Let's just go put these. Oh, more stuff. Yay. Oh no, that's not what I wanted to do. I have so many pumpkin trophies over here. I forgot what I needed to make. You know what? So that's We're what the, the dungeon again. That's what the morning wood trophy looks like. Then scarecrow shirt. Steak launcher? I don't have any ammo for it. Curse sapling, that summons a little pet. Ugh, I hate it when I have to trade it out for my donkey. There we go. And then he just flies. In a circle. I, they fix that? I think they fixed it. No, it's actually just in some... Oh. Situation. In this case, straight up and down. I think they fixed it because he's not doing what he used to do. Oh, I oh. think he's going back to this. Oh, no. <laughs> back into a circle. Well, that's what that does. Boom. Now he's gone. I already saw morning wood trophies. Scarecrow hat. Vanity item. Spooky wood. You can just place that down. Scarecrow hat. Just already saw that. Pumpkin trophies. We saw those. Scarecrow t-shirt. Vanity. Um, so just some banners. Come on. Where are some more weapons? Here is one. Oh, it's a summoner, kind of. It's a summon. It's a scarecrow. It's pretty nice. It does. I think it. I think it goes after stuff. Add two more. Huh. They're pretty. They're pretty cool. Nice. Can I get rid of it? Oh yeah, I forgot. Boom. Now it's gone. That scepter. Oh yeah, with the Spexier armor, this is amazing. Because with the Spectre armor, then you you get healed whenever you use magic, and this like barely takes up any mana, even with the sep even with the Spectre armor, and each of those bats do like a little bit of damage, but that just means that you get healed more because those little bits all add up. Like if you just kill someone in one hit, then you just get a little bit of healing, but if you kill something in like a thousand hits at once, that healing really adds up. So this is a really nice weapon to have with the Spectre armor. I just thought of something. Twigs. So, if I have all the stun stuff, then if I'm starting to drown, will I, like, not be affected? Sunstone, activate. There's a blizzard there. Okay, apparently the stun doesn't work. Okay. Whatever. Black fairy dust. I don't have... I don't know what that does. There's another pumpkin sword right there. Horseman's Blade. <coughs> this one does 86. Got a murderous jack o lantern. Oh yeah, I remember this. It explodes. Please tell me it still explodes. Mm -hmm. Yes! Ha! <laughs> My army of exploding pumpkins. I'm just like nearly escaping. I'm actually doing pretty well escaping. Look at them, they're just an army. <laughs> Okay, well that's pretty nice. And so that, everyone knows what the Horseman's Blade does. That's the reason that they spawn in this event. Candy Corn Rifle. It shoots ricocheting candy corns. 
Wow. That's strange. Kinda cool though. Already saw a bat scepter. That. Saw that. Already saw that. Already saw that. That's a feather. And already saw this. Already saw these two. Hey! It's not nice to hit women. And I think there's one thing that we didn't go over yet, which is the spider bag. Spider bag? Spider egg? It just it just summons a, like something that kind of looks like. Well, I'll show you. Put it in for the bone key. It just summons in that little thing, and then it like crawls on walls. Thank you. I guess it's pretty cool, and then it like flies on a web when you when you're in the air. Yeah. Well. That is all that this event has to offer. Like I said in the next video, then we will be having our Centrets face Gollum. Expert mode Gollum. And, okay. That will be it for this video. And, goodbye.